Do you want to know why the planet Jupiter has moons called Europa, Ganymede, Io and Callisto? Well, let me tell you. Jupiter is the Roman name for Zeus, the god. And we all know that Zeus took a lot of lovers. We've talked about Europa, Ganymede and Callisto, so let's talk about Io. Io was a priestess to the goddess Hera, who is Zeus's wife. So Zeus noticed her. And Zeus seduced and impregnated Io, as he always does with lots of women. But we all know that Hera can become quite jealous when this sort of thing happens. So in order to hide Io from his wife Hera, Zeus decided to turn Io into a cow. A very beautiful cow. However, Hera was not fooled. So she's like, oh, Zeus, husband, what a beautiful white cow. I think that you should give it to me as a gift. And of course, Zeus is still trying to hide the fact that this cow is one of his lovers. He has no reason to say no to Hera. So he gives Hera Io in the form of a cow as a gift. <laughs> Hera also asks the giant Argos who has eyes all over his body to keep a watchful eye on Io. She also sends a gadfly to continuously bite Io as they wander all over the world. Zeus of course realizes that this is really unfair so he sends the god Hermes down to distract Argos by playing his pan flute and lulling him to sleep and then he eventually kills Argos. Hera nonetheless wants to thank Argos for his services so she gathers up all the eyes all over his body and she puts them onto the peacock which then becomes her, you know, favorite bird. So these are meant to be all of Argus's many eyes. All the eyes. Eventually Io escapes to Egypt where she turns back into a human woman and she gives birth to a daughter and a son by Zeus. In some retellings of the myth, Io becomes the Egyptian goddess Isis. 